plus the new kind of fuel for your car or boat that's gaining popularity in South Florida. Coming up at 11 on South the government wants your child to get a flu vaccine. We'll explain why. What do vegetable oil, chicken fat, and even algae have in common? I'm Patricia Andreu. Going Green shows you an environmentally friendly way to fill up your tank. Plus, a South Florida agrees with mostly sunny skies both weekend days. Listen to this, Paul, because here's something to think about the next time you eat out. The grease from the restaurant's kitchen could actually be used to fuel your car. In tonight's Going Green, Patricia Andreu shows us a popular eco-friendly way to gain energy independence. What's this guy doing? He's using a fuel container to pour his wife a drink, and then he proceeds to fill up her tank. This is biodiesel. This happens to be 100% chicken fat. Bio what? It's 100% animal fat. So cheers. Goes in my car, goes in my mouth. Science teacher Bertha Vasquez loves this shock and awe. It's one significant way she goes green and the reason she bought her VW Jetta with a diesel engine. No conversion whatsoever. From the first time I, I purchased the vehicle, I put biodiesel in it. Vasquez buys her eco-friendly fuel at Seoul Atlantic Biodiesel. Since they set up shop last year in this Hialeah Gardens warehouse, business has been brisk. So what is it? It's an alternative fuel. It's non-toxic. It's biodegradable. And it's made in the USA from things like vegetable oils and animal fats. The funny thing is, is that the diesel engine, when it was first created, it was meant to run on peanut oil. So really you're coming back to the original, what it was meant to burn. Not only does it burn clean, it cleans your engine, plus. In addition to being a premium fuel, we actually offer it at a lower cost than petroleum diesel. So we're typically about 10 cents per gallon cheaper. And it can be used with any diesel engine from cars to vans, cement trucks, and boats. We tagged along on a biodiesel delivery. George Vistardis loves that his pleasure rides no longer pollute. I like to dive, I like to fish, so. Uh, it definitely uh, definitely strikes something with me. Another plus, no more toxic fumes. So no matter which way the wind's blowing, it smells more like a fast food restaurant than like fuel. Uh, you don't get the noxious fumes. You don't get the black smoke. You don't get the soot. Scientists are now trying to make biodiesel from algae, even from restaurant grease. Well, we don't recommend going to McDonald's and sticking it straight into your car. Biodiesel has gone through a chemical process to remove the glycerin content of it, so it's able to be used as a motor fuel. It's worth it. The environment is number one factor for us here. Like so many others, this first-time customer promises to be a repeat customer. And there's no single answer to our energy problems, but biodiesel is a wonderful start. Unlike most other alternatives, this is one thing that could be used right away. Patricia Andreu, South Florida, tonight. Seoul Atlantic Biodiesel is planning to expand to 10 locations across South Florida in the next year. For more information on biodiesel, log on to NBC6.net slash going green. The Centers for